Hello everyone, good day, I'm Joby John and today I'm here to show you how to use command prompt and some various codes or commands to be entered in. First, let's start knowing what is command prompt. The command prompt, officially called the Windows Command Processor and often abbreviated to CMD, is the command line interface for Windows operating systems. A command line interface is a way of interacting with the computer directly using text commands. Now I'm going to show you how to open the command prompt in Windows 10. There are a few ways to open the command prompt in Windows 10, but there are two convenient ways to open it. First is to type command prompt into the search bar next to the start menu to search for it. You can also type CMD, the short name of the executable that runs on the command prompt if you prefer. Second, you can press window key plus R to open the run box. Then type CMD and hit enter to open it. So here we are with the command prompt on screen and the first command that I will teach you is the ping command. Ping command is one of the most often used networking utilities for detecting devices on a network and for troubleshooting network problems. The general format is ping hostname or ping address. Let's example ping www.google.com and it will show you the ping here as you can see. Next, let's enter ping 1.1.1.1 and again hit enter and it shows the ping. Next command that I will teach you is the ipconfig command which is the basic use of this is finding your IP address and default gateway. In the command prompt, enter ipconfig then hit enter and it will show your IP address and default gateway. You can also try ipconfig space slash all and it will display more information about the network setup on your systems including the MAC address. And lastly, you can also try ipconfig slash flash DNS. And it will flash the DNS cache that can improve your internet a little bit. Another command that I'm going to teach you is the system info. This command displays a list of details about your operating systems, computer hardware, and software components. So enter system info in the CMD and hit enter. You see details such as the version of operating system installed on your computer, the status of your RAM, or the processor that you have. It also shows the current OS version that you have, the product ID, and the processors. Next command is the SFC space slash scan now. This command will scan all protected system files and replace corrupted files with a cached copy that is located in a compressed folder at this. It may take a while or a couple of minutes. But note, do not close this command prompt window until the verification is 100% complete. The scan results will be shown after this process is finished.
the last command that I will show to you is the CLS command and it only have one use and that is to clear the existing commands in prompts. For example, like this. We entered a bunch of commands in the CMD, in the CMD and you want to remove those previous commands. So just type CLS and hit enter and as you can see all the previous commands are erased. So that's all. Thank you.